had something to accomplish when I started skateboarding. There were goals every day, every minute. He just loves skateboarding so much. And I tried to feed that the best I could because I knew how important it was for me. Depending what neighborhood you want to go skate in, you could get robbed, beat up, shot, stabbed. If they like you, then you can skate. If they don't like you, they'll let you skate, but then they're going to rob you. Everybody from Love just thought, that kid's whack, man. I'm like, he might be whack, but he's doing some pretty hard tricks. I think that's when I recognized how prolific he was. Someone was like, hey, you got to see the Sponsor Me tape. And I was kind of like, what's the big deal? You know, whatever. We get Sponsor Me tapes all the time. A couple of the team riders weren't really feeling it. It was the most brutal grilling I have ever witnessed in my life. It was like baptism by fire. It's not just, oh, that dude was good because there's tons of good people. I don't want to just be a trick doer. He's the first true elite level professional skateboarder uh, who will be an elite level till his 40s. What's up, dog? Hey there, man. Great. And they kept saying, like, he's the oldest guy out here. I'm going to skateboard forever. The day that I can't, like, just shoot me. I started a skate career in the street. The story that's being told is the story of a skate rat kid who made it. 